What's up, y'all? You checking out the Frequent Flyer? And I'm back out here at Oxford Circles, Raiders Field. And I got the Ferry B Dark Max out here. And a 4S battery. 1300 milliamp hour tattoo. I believe it's um, 75C. It might be 45C. It's two different versions. I didn't look at it yet. Walking down to the other end of the field because I noticed that when I'm looking this direction, it seems to my camera lens actually handles the light a little better. When I face this direction, it gets dark. So I'm walking down this end. And I'm going to try to keep it towards that way. But we got somebody on the field. Let me check this battery and see the details on it. It's a 75C tattoo battery. So we're going to stay right here. Hopefully all works well. Okay, I got DSM running on this one, DSMX to be more precise. Got a Spectrum satellite receiver in here. I went with Spectrum this time because of the antenna length. I wanted the antennas to be longer. They're gonna take off from me holding it. Make sure we're recording it. Right off the bat, let's check out its punch. Got some of the buzzer on that one. So really nice punch. I think the Ferry B X215 might have a quicker punch. It might go up faster. Even though people are saying that it has a higher KV motor than this one. But it's not really that much. The KV on this one, I believe, is 2550 KV, whereas the Furry B is 2600 KV. That's virtually the same thing, just 50 difference. So, basically the same. Go for a power loop with it. Let's do some FPV with it. This is actually my first time doing FPV with a 5-incher. It's very windy out here. Whoa. <laughs> Trying to get lower to give you guys a sense of the speed. Let's 
try to gun it. Yeah, the speed doesn't translate well in the FPV feed. And I'm at my three minute mark already. Let's bring it back. Pretty fast, guys. And I'm just ignoring my three minute mark because I'm not getting any buzzer from the actual quad. Man, this thing flies, it shoots really far up in the air when you're throwing power loops. If you hit, the, if you lift the throttle, it's all the way up in the air already. So I gotta get used to this. Okay, we're at 14 something, so let's bring it back. I don't want to land in the grass, it's wet. So that's it, a quick demo flight in FPV with this Ferry B Dark Max. I think the X215 might be a little more powerful, the motors, anyhow it goes, maybe it's the props, I don't know, but the X215 seems like it goes up a little faster than this. And this does take five and six S, supposedly the x215 does as well i heard someone say that they didn't think that the x215's motors would take a 5 or 6s because of its high kv but the kv on these motors are almost the same <laughs> this is a 2205 motor and the ferry b x215 is a 2206 if i'm not mistaken and this is 2550 kv whereas the x215 is 2600 kv so it's virtually the same <laughs> i don't see the big differences so I, if i had a 6s battery i would try it um i think that's what i might do just get a 6s battery and try both of them if it breaks heck i'll just get some new motors <laughs> thanks for watching guys